saw this little thing and it looked like it would be fun. I have no idea why I ordered two of them though. Maybe I should give one away. Well, as much as I would like to do the video about the Max Slash and its uh, sway bar upgrades, um, it is miserably hot out there right now. It's uh, it's actual 99, the reel feels like 110, and the humidity is just, it's insane. It's utterly, utterly insane. So I figured I would try this little guy out because I can at least play with it inside because i don't think this little guy will go on a road whatsoever but that's not what it's meant for it's a nice little uh inside uh boy look at me not being able to open up a box it's a nice little uh inside drift car um i was watching this on one of the channels i think it was discipline rc if memory serves and uh he was just having a blast with this little thing and oh look at that jim Economy. so yeah they're they're uh, definitely going for that that hoonigan look oh okay so it's supposed to have uh completely uh uh brain damage uh, not brain damage, but proportional. <laughs> it's fully proportional steering, and uh, okay, I can see that it is all locked. So the center diff, front diff, rear diff is fully locked, and it's got some hard plastic tires on it. Um, there's no suspension in the back, but you know these things are really cheap. They're on Ally Express. I want to say they're about fifty dollars, give or take. Um, I'll, I'll put it up here somewhere where the front with actual price is. Let's see, got a nice little remote. Well, you know, it's a remote. I don't know how nice it is. I guess we'll figure it figure it out. But uh, easy for one-handed operation. I always hate seeing screws that hold down battery doors. It always, I don't know. To me, that just seems cheap. So, uh, we got uh, some trim, uh, speed, it's probably for a speed limitation, I bet that controls the light, nope, that controls the light, okay, that's probably for your hazards, and then that must be your power switch, oh, so I'll slap some batteries in that, and what else do we got in the box here, oh, we got some, some rubber tires, okay, I'm not much of a drifter, so I imagine I'll end up using those rubber tires, and we got a USB charger cord. Um, hmm. That is definitely not the scale. Wow. But I have some that might actually be a little bit closer to scale. Well, this is cool. At least I can set up a nice little drift course in the kitchen and annoy the cat and the cats and uh, my wife. But uh, interesting. So far, so far I like it. Hey, let me uh, slap this thing on the charger and slap some batteries in the remote, and then let's take it for a little drive around the uh, the house. All right, so got some batteries loaded up, got four AAAs loaded in there, and put a little bit of a charge on it, just because I was curious to see what it was like. And by the way, this thing was only $22.30, so that's why I bought it, because it was, it was really cheap. And for the money, I figured, pff, hey, even if it's junk, $22 is still not bad for, uh, you know, something like this. So let's see, uh, let's turn on the remote, uh, lights flashing, so it's probably, I 
fuck that was the power switch. Oh, okay, yeah, that is the power switch. Okay, so Come on, we'll drive. And let's see. Let's try to get both in this shot here. So there's the lights. Oh, I got some headlights and some tail lights. And Yep, that just makes them make some flash. And what do we got here? Okay, so that changes that light there. So okay, that is speed. So it looks like we got three different levels of speed. And well heck, I guess it's about it. Yeah, it does have nice um diet. I can't think of the word again. <laughs> Uh, proportional. There we go. Whoop. <laughs> it's not too bad to control. See, that's worth the $22 already. Oh. Well, it definitely works. So, I'm going to go annoy my cats. I'm going to go set up a little drift course on the floor in the main area and see how bad I do. All right, let's see what, <laughs> what it can do. I think it does. Hmm. Okay, so I've got it on the 100% power. And it's actually pretty easy to control. Let me, let me switch down to the lowest power setting. <laughs> All right, definitely needs a little bit more power. So this is a mid power level setting. Well, I'm not all that great about drifting around the cones, but I'm definitely good at hitting them. The cat is unfazed. You know what? For uh, for twenty two bucks, this thing is a hoop. Oh, Cleo. <laughs> I almost had a dip there. Yep, I guess I'm definitely good at hitting the cones. <laughs> Let me see if I can actually do a... Nope. <laughs> see if I can do a normal drift. I'm just going to drift around the cat.
Okay. As a drift car, it's fun, and I bet if I had some skill with drifting, it, it would probably be pretty easy to drift, because it's easy to kick its butt out, it's easy to change direction, and throttle control is really easy to modulate. Yeah, guys. I tell you what. For 22 bucks, you, you got you got to get one of these. <laughs> these are this is too much fun. Yeah, it is fully proportional. See, so when you want to go slow, uh, excuse me, Mr. Death Cat. <laughs> so yeah, low throttle control. It's got plenty of it. And it's got a lot of punch on the high end. I'm gonna put it back in the high power mode. And wait for the cat to move. It's got a whole lot of punch on the highest power setting. This little thing is actually pretty quick. Alright, I think it's time to put the rubber tires on it and see if I can maybe saw them through some cones. Because uh, I am not a drifter. So the tires are actually really easy to swap out if I could just keep the kitties away from it. You just, uh, just grab it and it'll slide right off. Blue. Eat my cones. That's my main coon. He's the big boy. Blue. Blue. Blue, stop eating my cones. <laughs> I'm going to run into you with the car. Anyway, going back to it. So then the rubber ones you just slip right on. And easier said than done. There we go. Yeah, so they just slip right on there nice and easy. So let me uh, finish swapping those out and then chase the cats. All right, now let's try this thing with the rubber tires. Oh, wow, that thing is... It's very quick with the rubber tires. With some traction. Okay, that is definitely worth the price of admission. And again, I'm not good about going around the cone, but oh, I'm not sure I'm good at hitting them. These rubber tires, it actually has very, very good control. It keeps itself in line, it changes directions right away. And it is quick. It is <laughs> very quick. Unfazed, 100% unfazed. It's wheel. Oh, it's like Walter wants to get in on the action. Okay, if nothing else, it does make a good kitty toy. <laughs> uh oh. We picked up some kitty fur. <laughs> yes, this thing is a blast. Alright. I'm I'm sold. I'm convinced. 
And I think, can I see? No way. It has working brake lights. How the heck are they gonna pack all of that technology, fully proportional, that quick, all wheel drive, with working brake lights, with working hazards, for $22. Alright, I dig it. I give it a thumbs up. It's just a quick video for y'all. I like this thing. If you haven't checked them out, check them out. I will have the link for it in my description. Go to Ally Express, pick yourself one up because for $22. Yeah. That's ah, too much fun. This is Dude RC. I'll catch you in the next one.